Hi guys, Amanda back here again, and as promised, we're here to finish up this adorable slimline no watercoloring card, and I am using the hexagon die from La La Land Crafts. It's double-sided stitched. Um, I made my own stencil with this uh, out of acetate, and I'm using the three hexagons that... Um, that I have here to line everything up, make sure everything is evenly spaced, and I'm gonna tape down my paper and my stencil. This is just a piece of scrap paper that I've been using for the last two years. Um, I use it for water scene cards, beach cards, uh, hillside cards. Um, it's just a piece of paper that I ripped and I liked the shape of it, so I just keep using it. I used Vintage Photo Distress Ink for the sand, and then I'm using the Gina K Designs Ink Sea Glass. I really like this color for the sea. And then the stencil I have, I don't even know where I got it. I'm really sorry. I'm bad at keeping items with brands, and if I know it, I know it. If I don't, sorry, but I'm sure you can find a squiggly line wavy blowy breezy kind of dye in any store or any company I'm sure they have one um, I've moved my stencil up and I'm shifting my paper from side to side for the sand to give it some depth and dimension and covering that back up to do the water again and I shifted my stencil so it's not the exact same pattern as the bottom one just moving it around, giving it a different style on each spot. I forgot to push record on that very last one, but you get the idea because that's what we've been doing this whole time. I'm going to place on my sentiment, life is at ease with an ocean breeze. This comes with the kit. It is adorable, perfect for this little card and all these adorable piggies. Here I've used the scallop die and I've extended it so I didn't cut it all the way to the very end on both sides. I've just left one end open and then I put it back through my die cutting machine a second time and lined up the scallops so that I get my very own slim line die cut. Layering on my white piece that we've just created so that the stitches show through. Very, very minimal bulk on this card, I love that. Gluing it to my business size card and then we're going to use pop dots to pop up our piggies. I'll catch you at the end. There you have it, our slim line card. I love these little piggies. I hope you guys enjoyed. Do stop again for some more crafting videos and don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification button. All links are in the description below. Thanks for watching. Bye.